Good morning, everyone. It's Rivecal. We're playing some more Dark Mouse. It's a Souls like. Uh, overhead, like Zelda style game. Uh, action game. Adventure game. There are two now. That's awful. Uh, last time we got our butts kicked by these guys. So I am hopeful that we can navigate through That's unfortunate. One of the big things with any Souls-like game is learning how to be patient with it. Um, something I am not always good at with this. Okay, so it looks like uh, we're currently looking for a key to a locked door. We don't have any information about where it would be currently. Uh, secret. Oh man, that's so weird every time the perspective changes. Let's get our shield up just to be safe. Uh, this is back where we were, which last time we were over here, we died. I think there's a, yeah, there's a mouse guy up there. Dawn, try this guy again? Last time he kicked my butt. Nope, I didn't. <laughs> I did not want to do that. Okay. Oh, I have a wooden shield, don't I? I wonder if that affects whether or not it burns. Much easier one at a time. And we uh, did well enough that our little shadow buddy's okay. Okay. Uh, with shadow buddy in hand, let's try this again. Or at least try and recover our marrow. I'll be fair and say I don't think this is where we need to go. I just really want to know if I can kill this thing. Nope, it keeps setting me on fire. Awesome. I can probably get back to that same spot pretty safely. I'm feeling a lot more confident fighting these bulls without really changing too much. Uh, one thing I will say is, it's seeming like I may, or, or whatever that, those red-eyed mice are, 
it might be good to look at those healing items I've been picking up as well. Okay, we're just gonna try it. We're not gonna try and fight him again. He seems to be kicking my butt. We'll wait until we get a little stronger. Um, but I did want to get those that XP back. Marrow is the XP. When you die, you lose it, just like in... Okay, and this is the boss that we had seen earlier. We didn't kill that bull! You know what? You know what? Maybe it's maybe it's time that we try a different direction. Cause sometimes when you're wandering around in one of these games, the best solution is to stop going the same way. Cause sometimes you might just need to try something different. close next to him they're not too bad but it's not easy to do that <laughs> either okay so we've run into like a boss and a couple scary things over here as well as just a multitude of these bulls i feel like at this point it's we can somewhat deal with the bulls so going left from here going west might be better to try i don't know if that's right that's just my thought. Um, I'm going to continue putting points in skill. Because that will both... There is a bull over here. That was enough for another level. Let's go ahead and just cash that in quick so we don't have to worry about it. And that's actually enough to try that scimitar out. Um, let's unequip the Tachi and maybe try equipping it here. sure how I feel about that offhand. That was mostly due to the shield, not the scimitar. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is definitely a really cool game. Um, crap out of our ghost, but I don't feel like that's completely unreasonable. Okay, so we just want to go straight west across this. I believe this were, was uh, birds? Yes. This thing is burning my stamina down real fast. Only downside. But it does hit pretty hard and swings pretty fast does not have much reach either I was I'm pretty proud <laughs> <sighs> that 
that was not what I was trying to do. In my brain, that made sense to do, but it was not what I was trying to do. Okay. really like to get to something new this time. I'm not sure I like this better than the Tachi. The moving enemies like the birds, by the way, I like these slashy weapons. The spear I'm liking a lot better as a general weapon, though. Um, you can hold the shield up while you stab. It's got a lot more reach. And it does have some... It does still have some flexibility as far as how... So that well, this is something new, because we had not come across that marrow patch before. Um, I'm actually going to, for the first time here, try using one of these healing items. Oh. I was expecting a confirmation message, and I just accidentally used two of them. But I'm at full health, so that means we can continue exploring at least. Okay, and if we don't go to a campfire, these bulls won't come back, so that's good. Although their shadow th that was just chilling over there scared the crap out of me. That must be the edge. Are you telling me that that's all that was over here? Does that mean that I actually need to go fight the bird boss? Uh, let's actually try. I'm curious. So this is back towards town. I'm actually curious if they will give any hints. Garrison door is locked. Search the gatekeeper in the eastern plain. I saw some bodies piled there. I found a little food. Okay. Hey, who knew that going back and talking to NPCs would end up being, like, helpful? Do I have a map icon now? Or was that general? A pile of bodies in the east. Great. Well, that's reassuring. Um, we do have three levels worth here, so I am going to go ahead and cash it in. By the way, I didn't mention it, but I did decide to go ahead and... Uh, um not try and uh there is not a way to reset and i did find a way to or i so i did not want to take the time to do that um i am feeling very i i realize that most of the time there's not a hard limit on like 
level ups in these games. So if I end up getting to a point where I'm not happy with it, rather than restarting or trying to cash it in, I can just start back over, or uh, grind rather, instead of starting over. Okay, we have a shield bash now. Awesome. Um, so, do I just head straight east here first, since this is less awful? Wait, this is the spiders, isn't it? Nope, this is birds. Okay, I can deal with birds. This is a little passage here. I don't see anything else, so let's just go ahead and stick low here. I think that makes it less likely that we're going to run into the bulls. Had we gotten here yet? I don't remember. But we'll go ahead and rest. That, give, that means we don't have to walk back through the bulls every time. This is not where the guard was. Let's go ahead and switch over to the spear. It's more reliable just as a general weapon currently still. feeling much more confident about that after having done a few fights and it's not feeling like it's because of the levels it's because i'm just starting to learn the patterns of it which honestly with these type of games again more important than the levels nine times out of ten although the levels help <laughs> the levels just mean that there's less skill required not that you don't need skill and learning it is definitely a thing. Seriously, that was the garrison key? Oh, crap. Is he just going to chase me? He is. Well, the good news is, we keep items. And, uh, we got to here before we died. <laughs> I'm very nervous about, uh... I'm very nervous about continuing here. That's so very... yeah. There's a lot of little stuff like the wind in this game that is very disorienting in a really cool way. It's one of those things that I'm not sure if I can properly describe. Like, I'm not touching the joystick right now and I'm just getting slid around, and it's not one direction like most wind effects. It's very... And here I was feeling good better about the bull. Honestly, that still went not terribly. There we go. 
let's head back up to the garrison. I'd really like to actually get inside and see what's there. terrified again. Okay. <laughs> These are different than the, like, invader mice, though. These feel more like regular enemies and less like Less like they're mimicking you. Yeah, this is very doable. We just need to learn how they work. Um, which is probably going to be a painful process, but is doable. Okay, there's marrow. Take a lot of hits, too. I keep dropping my shield. At, at like, they, the timing on their arrows is not consistent, which is very odd. Eat a morsel. That felt very doable. Just needed to be a little smarter about it. Traps hurt enemies, that's good to know. Warhammer hits hard and drains enemy stamina, but has a short range. Strength based weapon. Does that sound my shadow guy fighting something over here? That was very bad. Fire really hurts. A U bow. Fires rapids, or er, fires arrows rapidly. Okay. Two archers up there. Okay. That looks like a door. Um, giant door like this makes me think boss which makes me think I have three levels worth of marrow right now maybe explore a little bit more first or I have no 
idea what that means, but I'm gonna go towards this campfire. So if I die, I don't know what this means. Okay. Marrow, what? Health temporarily reduced. Marrow completely gone. Okay, that makes me slightly grumpy. to figure out if like my health is going up or if there's like a weight or like how I get it back I guess because half health is a lot like that's rough that kind of came out of nowhere and I didn't feel like I had a good way to actually do something about it So I guess, oh, that's another bad guy. <laughs> I thought that was my shadow guy. So I guess, given that I just lost a bunch of resources and I'm not sure how to get uh, my health back, before I go try and fight a boss, I'd like to fix that um, by whatever means I need to. Um. So I am going to end this one here. Got through a good chunk of this fortress, I think. Up, I'm just gonna do a couple rounds here. Maybe look up how to uh, get my my health back up so that I'm not feeling like I'm completely hosed. And we'll be back up here next time. Take on the boss. Finish exploring. Hopefully you're enjoying. If you are, please give me a like and subscribe. Check out the other content on my channel. If you have any questions or suggestions, please leave them in the comments. And as always, have a good one. We'll catch you next time.